how's it going? So, sorry, I've been gone so long. I've been kind of on my grind. I know I haven't posted a video in about like almost six months. Um, sorry. Well, so here's the deal. I'm really trying to be consistent with this thing. I really want to give good content and that means there's a lot of time editing. I just don't have the time to edit because um, there's been a change up in my schedule and I have a, a real solid focus for um, what I'm trying to do. Yeah, I just want a world title, no big deal though. Uh, with that being said, I will no longer be compromising not giving you guys any video content for what I think is perfect editing. That being said, if the editing is not great, sorry, I can't, uh, sorry. I would like to get you guys some information. I would like to let you guys know what I am doing um, right now because uh, I want to be a good steward of the things I've been given. Right now, I believe in this season, I've been given a platform by which I can honor God and uh, honor the people who are so lovingly supporting me. Thoughts, prayers, financially, whatever it is. Make sure that you guys are, are so well taken care of. With that being said, uh, here is the last few months starting in February. I went to the NCAA tournament. It was a great time. The following video is a brief exposition of February 2018 to the present. View discretion is advised. Nah, I'm just playing. I've always wanted to say that though. So it's 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 gonna be quite amazing and really wonderful. And I'm they said indulge. We get to indulge. Oh, but wow, look at those prices. Like no, I'm not. What up? I just arrived in Cleveland, Ohio, at the nine. Hotel Metropolitan at the Nine, and it's actually extremely fancy. Got its own little love seat here. Can you see me? Some TV setup, couch. They have their own ironing board. Uh, look at that. Precious. The shower, actually, really quite nice. Uh, bathroom. Oh, a very seductive picture. Uh, so obviously the reason for this trip, one, um, there is a national team camp here. It's going to be for three days. It's going to be Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Got a couple months till the U.S. Open. And then also, obviously, the NCAA tournament. It's like the pinnacle and like the height of the college wrestling season. Anyways, so more upcoming. Uh, here's the NCAA tournament. It's the only thing that makes me feel like I do. So I'm in Will Call right now, trying to get my tickets in the Arizona State section. Um, wrestling fans are the best, man. They're, they're awesome. We're intense. It's about to be epic. It's, we're committed. Yeah, we experience the emotion just like everybody else. From 2013, 2014, 2015, and 2016, I competed at the national tournament. Went to Iowa, St. Louis some other place and then at Madison Square Garden in New York City. So sometimes I forget that uh, people watch me wrestle so you know people are always like oh hey what's up Nishan? Uh, what's going on here and um, you know because I'm just thinking uh, me just being a regular person. I am just a regular person but it's just funny when people notice you. It just makes you feel good. Also helps I'm kind of like a little bit of a nice guy. Pretty friendly I'd say. That's Pete. <laughs> I mean, I really think that, like, at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. Winning is great, but it passes. Hey, my I yo. need to get in your vlog, dude. I know. This is awesome. Uh, nothing much. Just Nation's awesome. God bless. At the end of the day, um, you can have all the winnings, all the the Olympic titles, the NCAA titles, the, the success, the clout. Um, do you have life inside of you? Do you have joy? Do you have peace? Do you have do you have goodness inside of you? These things can only be found. And Jesus, and that's what it's all about. It's about knowing God, knowing who you are, and walking out that reality every every day, nonstop, full out, not living for yourself, but living for others and living for uh, something much greater than than yourself. I then went to Pennsylvania, hung out with, um, you know, had some amazing training out there.
And that's a wrap. Okay, bye. It's just good. Real simple, real easy. That's, I learned a lot. Coming into that was the US Open. I totally lost. I did not, I made it to the finals. I was wrestling really well and then um, I lost in the finals. Hey, Sean. came back and I beat the same guy uh, who I lost to in the finals in the final X for the world team spot. So the world team member at 61 kilograms, which is awesome. So I am the number one guy for USA at my weight class and I will be representing, um, and we I guess will all be representing the USA in Budapest uh, in October. So we're at the end of October. What we got coming up here, which is exactly why I want to keep you guys updated, is I'll be going to Colorado Springs again for the national team camp. And this is the first national team camp um, I will be going to as a national team, not only member, but a world team member. It's amazing. Praise God. We will also be going straight from this camp to Turkey. So. I'll be doing some filming in Turkey, hopefully putting out some, some content there. If it comes to the editing and it's just kind of fast paced, sorry, I can't get it all in. It's the only thing that makes me feel like I do.